want to talk about halitosis, in other words, bad breath. Before I start my speech, I want to tell you why I chose this topic. I didn't choose this topic just because it seems interesting. I chose this topic because I have a personal experience behind this. Um, last year, I was a victim of this disease. Um, last year's homeroom teacher got, had this concept, so though I wanted to talk with him and have pleasant conversations, I, was, I had to freeze myself and don't breathe in front of him. <laughs> Uh, therefore, I wanted to find why he got this disease and how he can get rid of it. Therefore, today I'm going to talk to you about three things. The definition of halitosis and the cause of halitosis and uh, lastly, the, fa the solution of halitosis. Let me begin. Halitosis is a term of explaining a person who has unpleasant orders coming out from their mouth. Though many people think halitosis is a relatively diagnosed disease, it is not. There is a standard called halometer, which, which led you guys to know whether you have a halitosis or not. And surprisingly, it is, it is regarded as the third biggest reason why people got, go to the dentist, according to the New York Times poll held in the science, science section. Then that, next, I'll talk about the cause. cause. Uh, there are four possible causes, mouth, nose, uh, body, and stomach. Though there are four causes, the first cause, mouth-related cause, consists 97% of the entire halitosis cause, so today I'm going to talk about that part. In mouth, there is a tongue, and in the tongue, there are huge amounts of bacteria. In the bacteria, the VC, VSC, which is called fertile sulfur compound, exists, and the process of resolving the protein from bacteria causes the smell. Moreover, uh, the, the process of decomposing, decomposing uh, leftovers of the food and dead cells and nasal mu mucus can also cause smell. Then, is there a solution? Sure, there's a solution. Just brush your tongue, that's all. However, some people think mint, using mint and have gargling can re reduce your smell, but that's not. That'll just cover your smell, so you, will, you, you won't smell at that time, but when time, when time passes, you will smell eventually. So you have to first, uh, first like brush your tongue, tongue while you're brushing your teeth. And also, when you're not satisfied with the result of your brushing your teeth, uh, brushing your tongue, I recommend you, doctors and I recommend you to scrape your tongue using a tongue scraper. They'll immediately get rid of it. Your uh, actually rid of your bacteria from your tongue. So what did I tell you today? First, the definition of halitosis. Second, the cause of halitosis. And thirdly, the solution of halitosis. To wrap my speech up, I hope my last year's uh, homeroom teacher can know about this and have this information so he can get rid of that disease and many students who are willing to talk with him can have pleasant talks with him. Thank you very much.